Hi everyone, it's Shannon from Canada Wig and I'm here with another wig review. This time we are looking at Scarlet by John Renault. This wig is part of their Smart Lace collection, so it has a lace front and it is a basic cap, so it is going to be a little bit lower priced than some of the other um, wigs out there by John Renault that have the monofilament top or that are hand tied. Um, the measurements on this one measure 10 inches in the front, 11.25 inches um, from the crown down, 9.25 inches on the sides, and then 5.5 inches at the nape. The color that we're looking at with this scarlet is um, Toffee Truffle, which is FS63027. So let's just zoom in a little bit and I will show you the color. So we have the 6, which is the dark brown base, and then the 27 and 30, which is kind of like an auburn brown sort of highlights going throughout. Um, you can see there is three colors in here. I, I feel like the 27, which I believe would be the darker of the two shades, is a little more predominant than the 30 is. Um, I think it can vary a little bit based on the actual wig style that you're looking at. I've seen some others in this color that um, do have the lighter shade that is a little bit more noticeable, but this one I feel like it's a little bit um, more subdued, I guess. It's just kind of in there, but not too, too strong. So I will show you. And I'll show you the lace front here too. You can see this one does have a little bit, it looks a little sparse, like actually up from the very top of the lace front, which is weird. Um, normally it's kind of sparse from the bottom down, but um, I feel like it has this bang here and, and that's covering it pretty well, but it is something to keep in mind with the John Renault lace fronts is that they can be a little bit more sparse. So it kind of depends on what you're getting and which wig style you get. Um, so this does have a permatease top and that is one thing that I, I have read and seen other people complain about quite a bit is there are little short hairs at the top. Um, I think it's to kind of help give it a little more body and volume. Um, I did see one sticking out when I first took this wig out of the box. Overall, I think it's not too bad. Some people might be really bothered by that and if you really are someone who always wears monofilament tops, then probably maybe this isn't the wig for you. You could look into like Julie Ann, which is a hand-tied version of this style, the same length. Um, but I was able to put the little piece that was sticking up down and kind of just hide it with some of the other hair. So I think that like overall, I don't think you can notice. Um, if someone's going to come up and look at you really closely, they might see it, but I think overall it's it's pretty good. So. Um, let's look at this one from all angles. So we have the front and the side. So overall, I think this is a really cute style. Um, I think it's fun. It's a little, it's above the shoulders, so probably easier to maintain. Uh, it's very lightweight. The cap is very comfortable. Um, it is your basic synthetic fiber, so you don't want to apply heat to this one. Um, it is long enough that you could kind of pull it back a little bit, which I think would be really cute given the um, the volumes of the volume and the, and the curl pattern. Like I think something like that would look really cute. I know some people have put it up and I think that that gives you a little bit of play options with it. Um, yeah, the cap is really comfortable. I think I said that already. Overall, I, I really like this one and I think it as it is a lower price point, um, it's a good option for someone who doesn't want to spend quite as much and who wants something that is still going to be really nice and has this beachy wave kind of look to it. So this is Scarlet by John Renault. Um, if you're interested in seeing more wig reviews, don't forget to subscribe because we are doing more on a regular basis. I hope you have a wonderful day.